Hey everyone, this is Monkey1000 and today I've got a review on these mug cakes. These are keto friendly mug cakes for people who can't eat sugar and also people who are on the keto diet. So um, we are not on the keto diet but we are um, watching our sugar as much as we can. So anyways, I had done one before and it was Duncan Hines and they were in a cup that we had done, my mother and I. And we did not like them. They didn't taste very good. So I wanna try these ones and see how well they look and good, how, how well they taste. So we're gonna do this. My mom is here too. There she is. So she's gonna be a taster, tester, as I am. So it always helps to have two. So here we go. Um, we'll be back. Okay guys, so each one is different. This one will start first. It's a triple chocolate mug cake. It has one gram of sugar per, per bag. And I'm gonna turn it over. It is, well, let's say here, one bag makes one cake. It's dairy free, three grams of carbs, and gluten free. It has 1.7 ounces, okay? So this is the ingredients here, if y'all want to freeze it and look at it. I think you guys can see that. There we go, a little bit better. And this one is a, the ultimate carrot mug cake. It has three grams of sugar. It is one bag, dairy free, four grams of carbs, and gluten free. It's 1.5 ounces. And here's the nutrition factor on that one, if you guys want to freeze it. So let's start with this one. I'm going to make this one, and then we'll make the other one. It says, let's make a cake. Okay. So it says, melt one tablespoon of butter into a microwave-safe mug. Use oil for dairy-free, if you want. If you don't want to use... Uh, the butter but we got butter we'll use the butter pour in sweet logic mix and crack one egg into your mug and stir well then you're going to microwave it yeah you can put this in the oven you can put it in the oven for 25 minutes at 350 degrees or you can microwave it for one minute so we're going to microwave them because if I'm going to use these I want them to be quick and fast and easy so let me get my butter and my egg and we'll get this going. Okay guys, so I melted one tablespoon of butter and I'm going to pour it in my mug. Okay. Right. Now I'm going to open up the pack and pour in the Sweet Logic Mix. Mm, I smell it. Chocolate? Oh yeah, it smells like chocolate smell. Yeah. Yep. It smells like a cake mix too. So I'm gonna pour that in there in my cup. And then it says, oh, I got a little bit more in there still. Make sure you get it all. It seemed to be on the bottom there. It didn't want to come out. And then it crack one egg into your mug and stir well. I got my egg. Here's my eggy. Can you see that? Yep. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to crack my egg in here. And there we go. Now we're going to stir it real good. Okay, so you can see what it looks like. I'm going to just keep stirring. I hope. Like I, she says, I hope it tastes better than the other one. And the other ones were from Duncan Hines. So I was quite disappointed in them. And I'll put that video at the end of this one. So if anyone who has not seen that one can go back or, or and look at it. So there, there you go. So it's they blended in. They had a funky in. taste, didn't they? Yeah, yeah, they did. Okay, so we're going to take this out. What's it saying now? Now we're going to microwave it for one minute. And when I come back, we, it should be done. You don't have to add any water? Nope, nothing. That's it. 
Really? Yep, that's it. Mm. We'll be back. Okay guys, so now we're going to do our ultimate carrot mug cake. And this one says melt one tablespoon of butter into a microwave safe mug or you can use the oil for dairy free just like the other one. You pour the sweet logic mix into the mug and one egg until you stir. You can also, there's my one, it's already done. It, uh, you can also put it in the microwave, I mean the oven, for 25 minutes at 350. Or you can microwave it for one minute. As I told you, we're going to microwave these. So I'm going to get my other one out and let it cool down for a minute. And we're going to get another egg and some more butter. And we'll open, do this one. Be right back. Okay, guys. Here we are again. Now we're going to pour our butter in here into our mug. Get it all in there as much as we can. Okay, and then we're going to put our, whoop, oh, gotta do it the right way. So we're gonna put the mix in first after you put the butter in. It's really up there on the top on this one. I don't know. I don't want it up. There, I got it down. Yes. And then we're gonna pour it in here. Mm, it smells like carrot cake. It smells good. You can smell the pack. Smell? Mm. That smells really good. Dad would have liked that. Yeah. And then you're going to put your egg in there. And we're going to mix this one up real good. And hopefully you guys can see, see it a little bit better. Oops. Okay. I'll show you. you. Just mix it up until it's all blended together. <laughs> so they both have the same directions. There's nothing different, which is good. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to stick this one in the microwave for one minute, and then I'll come back with the results on both of them. Okay guys, so they're done. It didn't take no time to make these. I don't remember if the other ones that were Duncan Hines, if we had to add, I know we microwaved them, but I don't, I don't know if we added anything or anything. I don't remember. I'll have to look at the video to say. So I'm gonna give her a fork so she can test each one. What one do you wanna try first? Chocolate. You wanna try the chocolate? Take a couple of bites out of that one and tell me what you think of that. It's a little hot, so be careful. Now, I'm, I'm going to tell you, they don't come flowing over the cup like they say. But when I was looking at the pictures, especially on this one, you can tell that the mug is more round and flat on the bottom. So I would say these are more like a teacup instead of a coffee cup. So, you know, that's why they're overflowing. They are not overflowing. They're halfway on these cups. And these are not very big cups. I have bigger coffee cups than this. So what do you what do you think about the first one? Well, it tastes like chocolate. Yeah. A little dry. Mm-hmm. Could use whipped cream. Mm-hmm. Or chocolate syrup. <laughs> That's not feeding the purpose of your diet. No. <laughs> I'm terrible that way. Mm. You take a taste and see yeah. what you think. I'm going to taste this one. You finish eating that and then we'll try the next one. This is the chocolate one that we're trying here. Could use some chocolate chips in it too. <laughs> <laughs> you're not doing what you're supposed to do. I know. Mm. Being diabetic is very hard. I don't find it that dry. I find it moist. I find it better flavor. You can taste the chocolate. Yeah. It yeah. is chocolate. Um, better than the other one. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Much better than Duncan Hines, a keto one. Yeah. That yeah. Duncan Hines one made mm -hmm. you want to puke. Yeah. It was, it was really bad. And... Um, you know, it had no flavor to it at all. No. None. None mm -hmm. at all. 
This one you have flavor. You have chocolate, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to say it's going to be as good as a real chocolate cake, no. But, I mean... If, you, if you're desperate and you need a, a chocolate fix, it's worth it. Right, yeah. Yeah, these doesn't are worth take it. you any time at all to make it, and it makes a nice snack or right. a dessert. All right, and you ready for this one? This is your carrot cake. So you try the carrot cake. Oh yeah, looks like a big cookie. Only fills about half the mug. But yeah, I already said that. But really, that's all you need, you know? Yeah, really. I mean, you know, it's a good little snack. You're watching TV and you have to have something to snack on. You know, you could grab this. And really, it's not that that fattening, you know? And it really wouldn't raise your sugar up too much no, either. it wouldn't. And so it, it's kind of something that, you know, I'm always looking for something different with diabetes. You know, you want to eat something at night because I don't want my sugar crashing. So I eat something before I go to bed. But I don't want my sugar being high in the morning either. Yeah. So it's a hard balance when you're diabetic. What do you think of that one? Tastes like carrot cake. Yeah, you like it? Yeah, I do. I like this better than the other one. Do you? Yeah, and I thought I'd like the chocolate one better. Okay. But this is more like a carrot cake. Okay. Let's try this one. Mm. Oh, yeah. Scoop of ice cream would go nice on that. Bad girl. Sugarless ice cream. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good, eh? Mm -hmm. That one's really good. Mm -hmm. It's the spices in it. Yeah. Well, carrot's good for you, really. Oh, yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, mm. yeah, I still find them moist. I don't find them dry. Well, this one's more moister than that one. I don't know why they had the same amount of stuff in them. I don't care. I like this one better. Because you like the flavor of the carrot, maybe? Mm, yeah, the spices. Yeah. Spices, I like that. I don't know what one I like the more. I really don't. Taste again. <laughs> <laughs> I like this one. But I like this one too. I was surprised in the chocolate because most of the time, you know, with chocolate, it doesn't taste like or it. Or it tastes phony. It has a bitter taste to yeah. it. Mm. I think I like the carrot cake more. But really, I'd eat both of them. Yeah, I'd eat both of them. Yeah. But the carrot mm -hmm. cake, to me, just simply because I like carrot cake so much. Yeah, but you're really a chocolate person more than I am. I'm surprised you don't like the chocolate as well. Oh, I, I like it, but I like the carrot cake better. Mm. Yeah. So, out of the Duncan Hines one and this one, what would you prefer? This one. Yeah, me too. I don't know Definitely. Who, who made this one? Um doesn't really say. Just called Keto Friendly. Sweet Logic, I guess, made it. Sweet Logic. And where did you purchase it? At Winn-Dixie. Oh, you got it at Winn-Dixie. Mm -hmm. Because I saw some at, um, was, were we at Dollar General the other day? Yesterday. Yesterday. Yeah. I saw some at Dollar General and I looked at them. Yeah. Yeah, but I didn't. I didn't read about them or anything, and I don't. So I didn't even see them at Dollar General. I so. did. Huh. I wonder how much they were. Well, I guess they'd be a dollar twenty-five. Yeah. How much were they? I can't remember. I will put it up on the screen though. I'll look it up. But I bought those at Winn Dixie. Yeah. I like the carrot cake. I really do. Now they have a couple of more. So since you like these ones, I'm gonna. I'll buy the cup. The other ones. That what they were have. they? Do you remember? They have a lemon one. Oh, that would be nice. And I can't remember the other one, but I'll get them and we'll try do another video on those ones and see how much you like those. Okay. okay? All right. Yeah. All right, guys. I hope you like the video. It's interesting to see. I very, very thought that Duncan Hines would have done a lot better than what they did. Yeah. But these are really, really good. I would eat these again. No problem.
so I'd probably buy them for us and we can have them as a dessert after dinner or we can have them as a snack watching TV or something you know and it's not going to affect us too much and it's not a huge amount and you could put Just whipped enough. cream we can put we can have whipped cream we can put a little bit of whipped cream on top you can get sugar-free whipped cream too that's the chocolate one. Oh, you're going to eat my carrot cake one. Ah. Anyways, that's it for now, guys. And we will, we will get, I'll get the other ones the next time I go to the store and we'll try them too. So um, stay tuned for those. So anybody that's watching their way and they want something sweet, yeah, get these. Yeah, it might satisfy you, you know. I know that sweet tooth can really get you sometimes. <laughs> Especially when you're watching TV at night. So, yeah. So, anyways, Monkey says she's out for now, y'all. Say bye, Mom. Bye, Mom. <laughs> and Monkey says she's out. Bye, y'all. Have a great day.